Hey gang, what's up? Welcome back here to another edition of Intuitive Angling and really appreciate you guys checking today's video out. I'm gonna give you guys the first day practice report uh, for the BFL Super Tournament that's gonna be this weekend on Lake of the Ozarks. Uh, today was my first day of practice. I'll have uh, another day of practice tomorrow and then the tournament starts on Saturday. So I'm gonna give you guys a little rundown how the day went. Maybe it's gonna help you guys out, uh, you know, learn something by the end of the week after the tournament's over. Uh, real quick guys, before we get started, just a couple quick reminders. I just wanted to let you know about our uh, September sale on my signature series, RB2 series, uh, solar bat sunglasses here. Um, if you buy a pair by the end of September, you get them at 30% off. And any purchase you make over $30, you get a, uh, excuse me, any purchase you make over $56, you get a $30 grab bag full of solar bat sunglasses. So I'll put the link in the description if you'd like to get you a pair. Much appreciated. Okay, guys, today is first day of practice, uh, Lake of the Ozarks. Um, I've, I haven't been up here much this summer. You know, I fished it quite a bit later in the spring and that type of stuff. So this is the first time that I've actually been up here since, uh, you know, first part of June or so. And um, it was a grind, man. I'll tell you guys right off the bat, it was not easy to catch them. Um, I expected the fishing to be better than what it was, but you know, that's the whole thing about practice. You know, you you start doing one technique and you try to get something to work and sometimes you hit on it pretty quick and sometimes you don't. But um, a little bit about my thoughts going into this tournament, how the day went, and what I'm gonna do tomorrow is, um, this is the transition month here in Missouri. I mean, we're starting to have some cool nights, and once you start doing that, it creates a few more options. I mean, for the most part, in the summertime here, it's all about, you know, well, it's live scoping like it is in every other lake across the country, but, you know, some deep brush pile fishing, deeper fishing, but once September gets here, it starts opening up some shallow water options, and obviously that's how I'm gonna fish this tournament. Um, is I'm gonna try to catch them shallow here. And the goal for me in this tournament right here is, um, you know, is making the regional here. Right now, I'm in I'm, I'm in 30 something place, I think, in the point standings. And they take the top 45 to the uh, uh, regional championship. So I'm in, sitting in pretty good position. So, you know, that that's on my mind a little bit. But the main thing that's on my mind is I am sort of, I look at this tournament as sort of a pre-practice tournament for the Toyota Series tournament up here in two weeks because the Toyota Series championship is at Table Rock Lake. And right now I'm like 50 something in the points. I figure I'm gonna have to come close to winning that tournament to make it. So I want to make that championship at Table Rock. I mean, that is my entire focus and goal is qualifying for that. So I'm, I'm really using this BFL tournament up here as sort of a pre-practice and um, don't get me wrong I you know I'd like to you know qualify for the regional but if I don't I, you know it, it's not going to kill me because I have got to figure out how to win that tournament in two weeks here if I'm going to make that uh, Toyota Series championship at Table Rock so therefore um, I'm fishing this tournament and the practice for the next tournament specifically on just what I think can win the tournament now there's there's about a half a dozen techniques that I know how to catch fish here on Lake of the Ozarks where I could probably go out and catch a 10 to 12 pound limit. And a 12 pound limit's probably gonna get you a check. It would definitely make make the championship for me or definitely make the, uh, the regional championship for me. But I'm not interested in 10 to 12 pounds a day, even though I know I can probably go out and catch that. I have got to put myself in position to catch that 17 to 20 pound bag. And for me, there's two or three, maybe four different techniques that can produce those kind of fish. And that's what I did today. I, I stayed with those techniques, those three or four techniques that I thought could produce bigger bags, how I've caught 20 pound bags up here. And it didn't happen. You know, I, I, I did not do any good at all. Like, you know, the, it, would, it would have been a very tough day in a tournament. Um, a lot of it was, I don't know, it could have been the area that I was in. I'm gonna to go tomorrow, my second day of practice, I'm gonna to go to a completely different area of the lake. I'm not gonna change my techniques. I'm just gonna change a different area of the lake because I feel um, in this tournament here that one of the techniques that, if I can get one of the techniques to work that I'm trying to get work, it can produce the winning type fish unless somebody just blows this tournament out away live scope and which I wouldn't put it past me. You never know how that's gonna go. But, um, I was a little disappointed to be honest with you. I got, I thought that, you know, today would, I thought I'd get a lot more bites than what I did today. 
the lake has dropped quite a bit in the last two weeks. It looks like it's maybe come up a little bit over the last week or so, but um, water's still warm. Water's 80 degrees here at Lake of the Ozarks, so we haven't had enough cooling to really move a lot of fish shallow, but I still think that there is enough fish shallow that you can win the tournament shallow if you fish perfectly. If you if you get on those techniques that, you know, you can get, you know, a couple, you know, good bites a day, you're going to have to catch a couple four or five pounders every day with the limit to win this tournament. And I'm sort of looking for about, you know, I, I look for, this is, since this is the super tournament, it's a two-day tournament, I sort of look for 30, one to 34 pounds to win this tournament unless somebody just get, catches a big bag out of left field so um if, if i don't think what i'm doing the technique is i'm doing can produce 30 plus pounds of fish i'm not even trying it but anyway guys i'm going to stay with the same techniques i'll get you guys clued in on everything after the tournament's over this weekend um i'll let you know how the practice day goes tomorrow i'm going to flip flop and go to a different part of the lake and uh you know try to to see if it's a uh, more of a uh, structure and condition thing rather than a technique so anyway guys thanks for tuning in and we'll talk to you guys tomorrow see you